Tunisia's top diplomat sought to reassure sub-Saharan African migrants on Monday in an interview days after comments by President Kais Saeed drew accusations of racism. Last week, Said called for urgent measures against hordes of sub-Saharan migrants whom he accused without evidence of causing a wave of crime and representing a plot to change the country's demographic makeup. Rights groups have since reported a spike in vigilant violence, including stabbings of black Africans, while migrants say they have been thrown out of their dwellings in mess and handed over to mob justice. The African Union voiced its deep shock and concern at his comments, urging member states to refrain from racialized hate speech that could bring people to harm. In an interview on Monday, Foreign Minister Nabil Amar said Said's comments had been tendentiously interpreted. According to figures from the Tunisian Forum for Economic and Social Rights drawn from official sources and confirmed by AMA, the North African country of 12 million inhabitants, hosts around 21,000 sub-Saharan African migrants who lack full documentation.